So is pattern carpet actually in style? In this video, I'm gonna break it down. What's cracking? It's Carpet Mike here from CarpetExpertBlueprint.com covering every single angle, strategy, anything you could wanna know about the carpet and flooring industry so you could go ahead and make an educated decision moving forward. So back to the opening question there. Is pattern carpet in style? And yes, in 2020, as if anything else could not go wrong, we decided to make pattern carpet cool again. Everybody's buying pattern carpet, nothing wrong with that. But from an installer standpoint, nobody wants to mess with pattern carpet. It's not fun, it's stressful. Yes, the final product looks phenomenal, but if we could avoid doing that, look at Dr. Pepper there in the corner. I should be getting sponsored by them. Anyway, back to the pattern carpet being in style. Yes, everybody's doing it. Some things to keep in mind though. If you have not shopped for pattern carpet yet, first let's talk about the monetary standpoint. You could buy a same priced phenomenal carpet and it will cost you much more to have the pattern carpet installed for a couple reasons. One, it takes longer. The installer cannot just fly right through a pattern installation like they can a traditional plush. The reason being, there is a rhythm to it. And what I mean by that is you can't just everybody grab a room and start blasting it in and seam it up. You have to start off of one point and seam all the rooms off of that one point to make sure the pattern lines up perfectly on every angle of the house. This takes more time, you're gonna spend more money. Next, there is the material cost. Now, you may be saying, well, if it's $40 a yard for this nice plush and $40 a yard for this nice pattern carpet, how is it costing more? The reason is you have to figure for the pattern repeat. So if you have 100 yards of carpet needed for, let's say, a plush carpet installation there, on a pattern, you may actually need to buy 115 yards or even 120 yards, depending upon the layout of your house, to make sure you have enough material to slide it back and forth and shift it this way and that way to make sure the pattern is going to catch at every doorway when you lay out the whole entire house. Nothing wrong with that. Just another thing to keep in mind. Make sure you got plenty of room on that MasterCard for us to swipe it and go ahead and charge it up there because you will be getting charged. Now, a couple other things to keep in mind. If you're doing pattern carpet on staircases, you're going to pay more for that. Now, if you go to the big box joints, they're charging you per stair anyway. A lot of installers don't charge you for a basic stair installation, but believe me, if you got to make sure that pattern hits on stairs on top of it as well, oh, you are getting taxed. So at the end of the day, pattern carpet is in style right now. It's trending right now. How long the trend lasts? Who knows? It could be one year, two years, 10 years. I have no clue. I did not see this making its way back into the marketplace and hitting as hard as it is. But in 2020, pattern carpet is a huge freaking deal. You will be spending more on it, but everybody seems to have disposable income right now too. I can't figure that one out either, but hey, if you love pattern carpet, go ahead and dive right in. Follow the trend. Buy that pattern carpet because if you can't beat them, we got to join them. Now, if you have any questions about the carpet and flooring industry, you know you can go ahead and drop those questions down below. As always, I truly appreciate you tuning into this. Thank you so much for connecting with me and I'll see you in the next video.